minus stuff. And this guy is going to attack us. And let's draw shadow cards. F6, F6. Untap. Okay, so we defend against uh, Miss Mountain Goblins. Cluck. Defending player chooses and returns one exhausted ally he controls to his owner's hand. If he controls no exhausted allies, well, let's just uh, put Gandalf back in my hand. How awesome is that? Discard. Tax for two, defends at two, no damage. This one is going to be undefended. Click, nothing happens. Encounter discard. We'll one damage, we'll put that on Berivore. I then attack for three, and I'm going to kill oh kill this guy. He did attack, so we minus one quest token from the scoreboard and this guy is now dead encounter discard sablunk okay so refresh all draw draw plus one everyone gets a resource tap new turn I'm pretty sure I've gotten I've forgotten to advance the turn a few times. I'll have to count. I'll stop the video and count before I do my scoring. Okay, so I tap her, him, or whatever the hell. Let's reveal. I've only got 13 cards in my deck now. So Yeah, what I'm gonna do is instead of doing that, what I'm gonna do is I'm actually gonna cast for one spirit, minus one, and play out Will of the West, and shuffle my discard pile, which is already 19 cards, back into my player deck. Send the to top of player discard. And now I'm going to tap him and look at the top three cards. Reveal to owner, top, top, ah, uh, so annoying, top three. Click. Okay, so, very powerful cards. We want all of those cards. This is obviously the card we're going to discard. We really want this card, and we really want this card. So... I guess we will swap this one. Oh, that's right, this is a swap. Yeah, so we swap this one, and we're going to swap that for this big dude. And then we're going to go... Uh, okay, we're going to do it like that. No, nope. we're going to do it like that. Okay, that's how we're going to do it. Then we're going to go done. Now I'm going to go click and call six. One, two. We get six resources. Let's put it on Eleanor. One, two, three, four, five, six. These are now discarded, send to the top, play a discard. We then tap this, and we're going to call five, one, two. There's five, and there's five, so we're going to get another five resources. And I'm going to place these on her as well. One, two, three, four, five. And now these get discarded. Send to top, play a discard. And you can see, this is actually designed for a two-player game. 
where you use this other card to, I think it's called someone, it's a law card and you can like set, give your resources to one person. So you stack all the resources on a single hero and then you can just give the other person like 40 resources a turn or something ridiculous. <laughs> it's pretty crazy. Okay, so then we're going to spend four resources from Eleanor. One, two, three, ooh, four. Yes, then four resources from Eleanor and stand and fight. Oh no, not stand and fight. Uh, and put out another tracker. Broken. <laughs> okay. And what else are we going to do? Let's spend another six resources offer. One, two, three, four, five, six. And stand and fight and bring out Bork. Send to the top of player discard. And remember, we've still got our two tomes here. And then we'll put out this and see what the next. Oh no, yeah, that is actually what we're going to do and see what our next card is. And it is a goblin. Okay, so we need to attack the goblin for four. Shouldn't be a problem. So that's one, two, three, four, five, uh, three, four, five, six, seven. So there's seven in the staging area, and we're going to quest for one, two. Oh, I forgot about the trackers. <laughs> so it's one, two, three, four, five. So we're questing for five. But of course, we put one, two, three quest tokens. So these guys are all destroyed. This has got victory points. Counter discard. 100%. Chunk. Pay one resource to put this back in our hand. And reveal. So there's two in the staging area. We are questing for five. So that's six, seven, eight. Uh, yeah, there we are. Nine, six, seven, eight, nine. And we have now finished that quest. But of course, we still have to scry. So that's F6, F6, F6. And of course, we're going to select the location because of our spastic trackers. Kind of discard. Okay, so draw shadow. And click. So what do we need? We need four to kill them. So there's three, four, five there. One, two, three, four, and we need four to kill him. So we're going to defend with Beyond. Click. Remove one progress token from the current quest. Of course, this has been completed, so there is no current quest. So that gets put in the encounter discard. He attacks for one, he defends at three, no damage. And then we attack with two, four, which of course is four damage and kills this guy as well. Oh shit, hang on. I forgot about this guy. I just fucked up that entire turn. Okay, so now I am defending this, but okay, what I should have done, what I would have done if I'd done this correctly is I would have defended this attack here, would have been defended against Berivore, and this monster would have been defended against that guy. So hopefully that's not gonna screw us. Shouldn't make too much of a difference. So defending with Berivore, click, Deal one damage to each hero with a clue token. Oh, hang on, we don't have any. Counter discard. Splat. Uh, 
and now tap like so this guy has no counters on him by the way and now we're going to attack for four that's why I was counting four we're going to tap to four one two three four which puts three wound counters and kills this goblin okay fresh all draw draw plus one okay we have another protector of Lorien which we can attach to a hero okay okay so what do we want to do here is there anything we want to actually cast count a discard uh, not a count discard play a discard there's nothing really in there I guess we could cast more Gandalfs why the hell not we don't have another will of the west yet which is kind of sad okay so we'll pull off one resource and we're gonna stick protector of Lorien on bearable for defensive purposes and we're then going to tap and check out the reveal to owner top three okay so this is an interesting one we want I think we want this card the most so we're gonna take this and we're gonna replace it with this dude that we can't cast and then we're gonna put him up front and do it like that and click done then of course we go tab draw draw and of course we get the five resources one two three four five these get discarded center top play a discard ah sigh so now what uh, I think I'm going to tab that draw two cards, one, two, and place an ancient Mathem minus one resource upon here. And I've got six resources left. So I am actually going to cast all of my six resources from here. Oh, actually, I'm gonna cast, th I'll just cast three okay so what I'm gonna do <laughs> it's the never-ending turn so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna cast three resources from Berivore and play out this reveal to owner top three okay so we're gonna put this in our hand Uh, yep and click done then we're gonna go tap call out five I should probably do that draw draw get five more resources which we are going to place upon Berivore again one two three four five these guys are now getting discarded center top player discard send top player discard so let's minus one two three play out greeting one two three four five six center top of player discard then we're going to minus one two three four five six and play two